What's up everybody? How's it going out there? Y'all know who it is, Lost with Jerry. I am back again. Man, I like to say thanks to everyone that tuned in on my video, man. I mean, it got up to what, 8,300 people that viewed my video. It was really nice, very wonderful. I'm loving it. So, just like I said, I need a new name for the car. It's not going to be the Dotmobile. It's gonna be called Ruby Red. So, that's what we're gonna do it. Ruby Red, it was more Ruby Reds than anything that came up on, on my uh, channel. So Ruby Red is what it's gonna be. So, uh, man, I'm gonna give y'all a little story about the car. It kinda freaked me out a little bit. I was a little bit upset about it, but I got over it, you know? But yesterday it was more like, wow, I couldn't believe it. But anyway, I need you guys to take another look at the ruby red before it gets dark outside. Y'all see the clouds is getting kind of dark up there a little bit, but a little light still. But anyway, we are still here. But anyway, I'd like to say thanks to every last one of y'all out there. I appreciate every last one of y'all hitting the uh, notification bell, liking the video, leaving nice, beautiful comments. You know, I'm loving it. It's a beautiful thing. Man. But let's take a look at ruby red. Now, like I said, ruby red is very pretty. You know, it's it's more than a red. The way I'm keep looking at this is more like a burgundy red. It's not just plain red red. It's more like a burgundy red. So, by getting up close up to it, y'all can see it red. But by me looking at it, it's more like a ruby red. So, I did buff it out last night with the uh, compounder. It was already clean, but I did it with the compound to get some more uh, little fine little scratches off, off off of it. Look like it's been ran through the car wash too many times, so I decided to go ahead and buff it out with that. I got the clear coat that I'm going to put on this. I'm going to buff it out with that at 3,000 RPM. That's going to brighten it up even worse. It's going to make it very slippery, slidey, whatever you want to call it, but... It's gonna be looking nice, but I cleaned out the whole inside, detailed the whole inside out, shampooed the seats, carpet, back over. Uh, the dashboard did the inside windows, outside windows, door jams, I did it all. All right, even the chrome that's on the front, everything looks good. It looks real good here, you know what I'm saying? So she in good shape. I like the way she ride. I like the way she feel. You know, uh, I'm kind of missing the dot mobile but you know it's okay to start off with something different you know get something different make it feel a lot better as y'all see y'all don't see the uh lost with jerry signs in the window yet those are coming real soon to get those done and the tent windows will be coming because i'm not used to clear windows like this every car i ever own i always got tent windows put on it so I will begin tint windows put on this. Another thing, you guys, y'all will not believe. Boat patterns on the wheel. Same size of the dot mobile. Same size. So the black ones will be going back on this one. Take a look at the body of the color of this car and think about those black rims that I had on the dot mobile. It's going to be back on this. They will fit on this. They're the same size boat pattern. That's a 5 by five by 1, what? 5 by 10. I'm just going to put that there. 5 by 10. And that's what it is for this car. So, even though it's going to get time for winter time, I'm going to have to get some uh, new meat put on here. I got warranty on this car. So I'm going to talk to them tomorrow and see if I can get new tires put on here. Because them tires got to come off. There's a warranty on it. Remember, ain't nothing coming out my pocket. They're going to have to replace these tires on the car because they ain't no good. So they're going to have to come off. I don't want them on there. It's a different sound to them. I don't like it. So those got to come off. And um, the car came with uh, 39,000 miles up to three years. Trans engine everything so and plus with the great insurance i got with the car um i had to get back with my insurance company um they gave me the insurance that i needed somebody decides to crash this car or whatever man i'm covered they replace it 
they cut me a check and replace it. I can replace it with whatever I want. So that's a good thing. Another thing, Lawsuit Jerry didn't have to put a dime up for this car. Only thing I did was trade in the dump mobile. There was zero down just to get the car. And that's what we're gonna leave it at. You know what I'm saying? So I got what I wanted. I'm happy with it. Uh, I had to think about the family by getting the car. So, you know, by having them on my side, you know, because I just didn't make the decision on my own. I talked to my girls. The wife kept on telling me, need a new car. So when my wife said we need a new car, I'm going to get me a car. But I had to take a minute to get me a uh, car, you know what I'm saying? But I finally got it. But she rolled in it once. The girl drove it, uh, took a turn to drive it once at a time. You know what I'm saying? They drove it at least about two times already since I had the car. So, I mean, they ain't enjoying the car. They want to drive this car every single day. So, when I pick them up from school, they drive it. You know, whenever they got to go somewhere, they drive. So, I got to make sure they stay behind the wheel at all times until they get their license, you know. But other than that, it's great. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, we're just going to enjoy this car the same way we did with the dump mobile. When CJ passed it over to us, you know, that's another thing. He's a good, CJ on 32 is a good man, good person, you know, and y'all just don't know, you know, and just like I said, you know, before, he helped out a lot of people, a lot of people. And he helped me get back on track, you know, by helping me out getting that other car, you know, and, and I got to the point that I can get this one on my own, you know. And he haven't seen the car yet, but um, hoping one day when he get back from Vegas, whatever, he can go ahead and take a look at the, the new Ruby Red car, you know. Or, yeah, Ruby Red car. So, Red Ruby, whatever it is, I think it's Red Ruby. I got to keep that in my mind. Red Ruby, that's what it is. So, that's the, the name of the car. It's going to be... And um, I'm going to hook up with Zay. And he's going to do another intro for me for the uh, the new Red Ruby car, you know. And we're going to try to get it to the point where I want to get it at, you know what I'm saying. Because he's a wonderful person, you know. I'm going to come down making intros. So I'm going to hook up with him with that. Get that done for the new YouTube channel, you know. And plus, you guys, I am at 15,993 subscribers. I'm like six points away, uh, subscribers, a new family to come and join Lawsuit Jerry. The BS 16K. Man, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Just like my homeboy, one of a kind, always say to me, Lawsuit Jerry, 20K is on the way. I can't wait to get to 20K because 20K is going to make a great, a great life. You know, 20, 20K, man, I'm going to love it. It's going to be beautiful. You know what I'm saying? So, just like I said, I thank you too. I thank you guys out there, man. Thank all my fans out there. And, man, we're just having a nice good old time, you know, with this. We're going to have a nice good time with it. But we're going to get the... The dot mobile O rims, and we're gonna put them back on this car, and see what it looks like when the time is coming. They only gonna be on here for maybe for like maybe a month, and then I'm gonna take them off. But I want to put them on here and see what the car looks like with those rims on here. So those are still 22s. They're still in good shape right now. I am in the garage polishing those down real good, you know, shine them up, and uh, then I gotta get the lift kit put back on here. And and then I'm going to end up putting the wheels back on, you know. But I want to make sure everything is okay before I put the wheels back on. So that way I know the car is safe to ride with the 22s. But when people do put 22s on their car, it don't mess up their car at all. A lot of people always say that it doesn't mess with your car. The it, it, only way it's going to mess up your car the way you treat it. If you hit the potholes, hitting the curves, or trying to run over the railroad tracks... Stuff like that, that's the only way you're going to mess it up. But you got to slow down for your railroad tracks. You got to watch out for your potholes. And you can't make a sharp turn by hitting that curve. Otherwise, you're going to mess up your rims and you're going to mess up your tires. So that's the only way you're going to mess up your car by 
doing those things with those 22 inch rims on your car. So, you can't even spin tires on them. You know what I'm saying? You got to cruise in it. You know what I'm saying? You can get on the highway and roll that 75, 90 miles per hour. It's going to ride good. But you got to take care of those rims and them tires on that car. No matter what it is. All right? So, I'm going to enjoy the Chevy Malibu Man LT. You know, like I said, the heated seats work good in the car, man. I mean, I like that. I like that dashboard, man. I tell you, with that wood grains going around it. See, it's shining already, man. It's chromed out up there. You know, I polish everything. So, the radio works. I got uh, different bands of radio stereo I can go to. I can listen to blues. or it's, It got that cell light stuff in it. The buttons up there, all of those work. Those came with the car. So, that's, that's going to be on there for like four months. They gave me two on there for um, emergency road site, whatever. So I can use that, you know. I test it out. It works good. Uh, the stereo uh, buttons here, cruise control, whatever you got there. You got the foot pedal button there for the throw it down up inside the manual. You know what I'm saying? Uh, man, the seats looks beautiful, man. The seats was dirty at first, but they are clean. I, I mean, I shampooed the mess out of them. The flow mats is, is coming out. I'm getting rid of those. I, clean the carpet and stuff like that I just put the mats back down because I want the um, mats to keep everything at the bottom clean on the on the floor so I don't want those to really get dirty anymore so the carpet is fine if I can get some plastic I put the plastic down maybe I'll talk to my homeboy CJ on 32 see if I can borrow some plastic from him and I roll this plastic up inside this car uh, just to protect the uh, carpet you know that way I can put the flow mats down. But man, I'm loving it. But just like I said, the cars ride good, man. I tell you, it sounds good. Man, I'm loving it. I'm enjoying it, man. The heater works good. You know, the air conditioning works good. I mean, everything in this bad boy works good, man. Ain't no check ins and light on. Nowhere on the car. Man, I'm loving that. You know, that's just a seat belt, whatever. Got my gas in there, you know, but like I said, it's a beautiful car. I like the color. I'm loving the color on the outside. I love what they did with the inside. So I'm loving it. So I'm going to enjoy this car as much as I can, but I drive to work every day, come home with it. You know, <clears throat> I washed it yesterday, buffed it out, you know, well, I buffed it out on Sunday, but I washed it on Monday and now I'm gonna put the clear coat on it as soon as I find some time maybe tomorrow whatever and just buff out the clear coat on it you know get that glaze shine into it you know and I'm gonna videotape that for you guys and let you see exactly what I'm doing when I'm putting the glaze on and see what it turned out what it looked like when I use the buffer and the chemicals I put on it you know what I'm saying so uh, man it's looking good I love the heated seats man I love the power seats, you know, uh, I mean, I'm loving it, and I would like to say thank you guys out there, every last one of y'all, man, and the ones that went to my cash app, man, you know, gave a little money, I appreciate that, man, you know, and good things will be coming to you guys soon, so I got to catch up with my homeboy, Fly by G Money, hook up with him for um, the hoodie merch, and talk to him and see what I can get going with that. Uh, if he's back in town, uh, man, I text New York the other day for, um, man, what I text New York for? I text him for something. I forgot what it was. No, I don't know what it was. It, I text him for a PC number. He didn't have it. Queen Tay didn't have it. So I had to Google up, uh, PC up. And I got to get with him because a couple of people in my job want to get their cars painted. So if they can drop it off for the winter time, whatever, and get it painted, then find them trying to find out what I did with PC number, man. As soon as I took everything out, the old dot mobile inside the garage, I'm going to have to go in there and look up and see if I find this number out there somewhere and get my holler and stuff like that. So that way I can talk to him from there and see, see what he say about having a couple guys bringing their car, cars out there and getting them painted. One's a pickup truck and the other one is a Yukon truck, 
both of them black so i'm trying to see if uh if we got time to do their uh, trucks for them and be done with it but man i would like to put pc on top of my car too but you know it won't be worth it you know i'm just gonna keep it like it is the color is beautiful you know and black that's gonna go along with it it's gonna be looking good and maybe I can find somebody to tint the windows. You know what I'm saying? So I gotta find somebody that's gonna give me a deal on the windows and, and get it uh, tinted for me and be done with it. So, you know, it's gonna be nice. Just like I said, be careful out there, you guys, man, and stay safe. And, um, man, lost who Jerry cared about every last one of y'all. Man, and I love every last one of y'all. I really do. So, I got what I wanted. I'm going to deal with it. I'm going to keep on going with it until she pay for it. So I got a good deal on it. Because I went back to him twice and said, hey, I need a better deal. I got a better deal out the car. So I'm happy with it. You know, and I couldn't wait to send pictures to my brother, my sister, my aunties, my uncles. And they was like, wow, that's a beautiful car, man. So, yeah. And found out the rims that's on there, they are hood caps. So, we can't deal with the hood caps. We can scratch them up all we want to, but they still shine. They still look good, but those are going to be coming off soon, next year. But, anyway, <laughs> I'm loving it. You know what I'm saying? But, I got to thank God, too, because he's the one that's watching down on me. He makes sure I got exactly what I wanted. And somebody said something about the fortune cookie piece of paper. Yes, I believe it. You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna have to go out to the Chinese restaurant and give me some more of the Chinese food and give me some more of the fortune cookies and pull that paper up out of there and see what else I can get out of it. You know what I'm saying? But it will happen. You know what I'm saying? So I appreciate everyone out there. Alright? Be careful out there, man. And keep on hitting that notification bell. Let's get this Lawsuit Jerry channel up to that 16K. Let's try to push it up to that 20K, you know? And then I'm good to go. You know what I'm saying? So I can see good things coming to me if I get that 20K. I just need everyone to hit that notification bell. All right? Lots of Jerry gang. I will be checking in with y'all another day, another time. All right? Peace. Be safe.